Has anyone seen Evan? Uh, we're starting a show, looking for Evan. Uh, Melbourne. Good hey, morning. Man. You were late. Thank you. I was, I'm sorry. I in actually just ran in <laughs> from my bed. I can see that, what? unless that's your normal day this wear. Is, no, this is, these are my pyjamas, actually. Okay, that's fantastic. Can I say, I don't actually wear pyjamas. No. I wear, like, briefs and a shirt. That's pretty much it. Uh, that's a bit... <laughs> is it too childish for me to be wearing pyjamas? <laughs> 20 seconds into the show, and I've given away too much already. Yeah. Welcome to uh, the week off. Uh, it's the week off for Get Serial. Yeah, because Get Serial TV is taking a week off. Mm -hmm. So we thought, why not uh, we'll hijack do our the own studio? Show. And yeah. I actually love that you actually you know, made a sign and everything. It's great. Yeah, it's a pretty cool sign. It actually says the week off. You can't see it on your TV, but um, it does say the week off. Imagine. It's the magic of television. Um, you can imagine that. <laughs> that it actually says that rather than just week off. But for, uh, for the week off, um, as we get new hosts ready for next week, uh, Evan and I will be taking you through the week. Yep. Uh, we've got a lot planned. We've got some Plenty. special guests too much. coming. Too, too much, much planned. Looking. It's too much to fit I into now. I love that you, we're planned, apparently, but you're still late, aren't you? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, coming up on the show today, Thomas will be coming in. Yes, Thomas, the old host of Get Serial TV. <laughs> I, I have he a just couldn't stay away. Sneaking suspicion he's going to try and take over the show. Maybe. I don't know. But he's apparently going to give us some tips on um, how to become good hosts. Yeah, because I've never hosted before. You, you've hosted. I've hosted before. You've hosted like two though. years ago. I wrote a book about hosting. TV you did, hosting. actually. I think. If we, if we, can we, I don't know if we can get a shot of this, but <laughs> this is actually hosting TV for dummies. Uh, can anyone see it? Uh, here, here. Written, if, if, if can we zoom in a little bit more? I don't know if we can zoom in on that. I don't know if we can... Are you able to zoom in? Zoom in. Quick. Whoa, whoa. At the television. bottom there, it says... Written by, written Leon, by Shogun. Leon Shogun. There we are. So that's me. That's it there. Leon <laughs> actually wrote the book, Hosting TV for Dummies. Definitely. Um, um, as well as that, we are, um, we went on a... went snuck behind a live TV show last week to we get did. some tips. So, we, uh, the, the Mutant Way, we went and snuck behind, behind stage to talk to some people. Mm -hmm. And um, look, that will be coming out later on the show. Absolutely. Lot, lot, so make sure you stick around. There is a lot of stuff, yeah. Welcome back to Get Serial TV, the week off with welcome, Leon and Evan. Welcome back. Thank you. That's Evan. I'm Leon. Yep. <laughs> For people that don't know, of course. Who wouldn't know? Yeah, I don't know. Hey, well, being um, here at Channel 31, it's great. Love it. Love community TV. But only thing is, we don't get to pay for parking. Yeah, well... Uh, uh, so we don't get parking paid for us, sorry. Well, yeah, so if people don't validate our parking or whatever happens in actual TV land. Mm -hmm. What happens if you go to the ABC and you try to park? <laughs> I'm sure they, they have... I've actually been there. They actually just have a parking spot, I, but I it says only for, like, employees. No, so. but they have show, the chauffeurs. Ker Kerry O'Brien actually um, takes your car off you and parks it for you. Oh, great. At, at the right tip, of course. See, but we, we here, we don't have Kerry O'Brien, and I actually... From the 7.30 report. And I don't know where your car is, but my car's actually... Uh, in the uh, you know parking sort of area, where I'm on a meter, um, yep. so I've actually got uh, actually my little sister because I'm mean, uh, standing out there waiting um, just just we're so I cross can. We're crossing live, are we? Yeah, we're crossing live to her. So, uh, uh, Steph, Steph, are you there? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. I hear. Oh, cool. Uh, so, um, uh, can you tell me just uh, have I got yeah, enough yeah. time left, you know, to to actually you know yeah, finish? Yeah, yeah, you got about 47 minutes left. 47 minutes, okay, uh, cool. Thanks for that, I'll uh, check up with you later on in the show. Okay, bye. <laughs> cool, bit of a satellite delay satellite there. Satellite delay there. I have to say, it's very sunny outside already. <laughs> it is. What's the weather going to be out there today? I thought it was supposed to rain, but it looks nice, blue skies. <laughs> and it is incredibly sunny. That's a true live cross? Absolutely. Was, uh, wow. There, there, there should have been a little live logo in the corner, but <laughs> um, it's obscured by the uh, fair go kev. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately. Um, you, as we said before, you can text in any time, 0458 905092, about anything you want. Um, and we can see it live here. See, I've got a laptop here, and I can actually see it. If you text in right now, I'll see it on my screen. He's bragging about his laptop. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looks good, the colour on you. Oh, yes. Uh, sorry. All right, well, we took one thing out of that. Is that a paintbrush? It is, yes. 
<laughs> no, it really is. Uh, welcome back to the week off. It's uh, we're taking the week off for get serial TV. There are thank you everyone there from the Mutant Way for giving us some tips uh, on how to be a good host. You look beautiful. It's okay. Don't worry. <laughs> We've got heaps we, coming um, up. We actually got a text in. Someone mentioned uh, your PJs, Homer Simpson ones. Yes, they are. They're Homer Simpson PJs. So. And you're going to keep them on all show, aren't you? Yeah. And you can text in 0458 90 50 92. Mm -hmm. And I'll, I'll, I'll like read it out. Anyway, we're going to go to a break now. We'll see you on the other side of that. Thomas is up next as well. And yes. Twitter Watch. <laughs> Welcome back to the week off. It is uh, Evan and Leon filling in before the new hosts take over for Get Serial TV. But speaking of, well, not new hosts, old hosts, welcoming back to the couch, <laughs> the other side of the couch, Thomas Moyer. Uh, I'm pretty free these days, so <laughs> if anyone needs a host or, you know, I, I'm, I, I'd love a job. <laughs> You, you actually came in here today to give us some tips. But yeah. before we do that, we actually, actually sat down on this couch. They're like, oh, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not hosting anymore. Oh. Um, but I don't know. Like, I, I feel as though more than anything, you two need to establish your roles on this couch. I figure, oh, like, I, I don't know. I, I figure hosting it for 10 weeks, I think that, I don't know, I'm sort of qualified to give you some advice. But the most important thing that I think uh, you should clarify before, you know, you proceed the rest of the, the week off is um is that's the name yeah, yeah. yeah. cool that's what it's um the now most breakfast duos it's a male and a female i'm the male uh what i've noticed is that you two are both males you know assumedly um you're both males on the couch <laughs> did you just yeah. look at my crutch <laughs> yes i did actually <laughs> that is the quickest <laughs> that's the quickest way of telling um so it's not a problem that you're both male but i think it is important to work out who the male and who the female is in the relationship like if, uh, if ever, you know, you had to dance uh, on air, you know, who would lead and who would follow. So, <laughs> Have um, you seen me dance on air? We're uh, playing that yeah, later yeah, in the week. I, you, you're a horrible dancer. Um, <laughs> yeah, I second that to uh, You texted in that day. You yeah. said you specifically texted in just to say how horrible I was at dancing. Yeah, sorry, but I, it's true. I can see there's some makeup there. I want to ask who's wearing makeup right now. Evan was wearing makeup. <laughs> you're wearing, okay, Evan's the Evan's That's a the point female. towards a female. Is that it? I, I think that's Everyone a Everyone wears indication. makeup on TV. Didn't you hear that we had a video? I, I, I I'm not wearing makeup. Thomas isn't wearing makeup. I'm not wearing makeup. <laughs> You're my Melissa man. Doyle. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> all right. The second thing you've got to uh, clarify or work out is um, who's going to be the anchor? Who's the stronger personality out of the two of you? <laughs> and I think the best way to uh, work this out is with a stare down. If you stare into each other's <laughs> eyes I and laugh. the first one to blink or to sort of I don't know, cower away. No, is, he's uh, really creepy at doing this. <laughs> yeah, he is a bit creepy. <laughs> All right, ready? Go. Are you commentating? He's making his eyes okay. do that weird thing yeah. like that. All right, Leon's making excuses already. No, I'm not. I, I, this is just getting weird because oh. he said he's my female partner and now I'm staring in his eyes. I, I think Evan's got the I other blinked. hand. You blinked. Have to blink. Yeah, he, he did blink. Okay, Evan, Evan's Evan. the anchor or the stronger personality. Or the um, creepy one. Welcome back. <laughs> or, the, or, the, or the weird one. Um, the final thing you need to work out is uh, who's going to be the funny guy, you know, on the couch. Who's the... <laughs> well, well he's just the going, one yeah, yeah. No, I'm just saying, he's the one wearing pyjamas. Yeah. He's got the visual gag written on him all the whole morning. That's true. That's true. I think you've got the upper hand already, but what I was thinking is um, who can tell me the best joke right now okay. will determine, like who will, the joke that I find the funniest will determine which of you is going to be, you know, the funny, crazy guy. Mm -hmm. So, okay, Leon first. I'm bad at telling jokes. Have uh, you got any jokes off the cuff? No, I don't use, all right, I actually can't say that's too rude. Um, <laughs> where does Dracula keep his blood? Um, I don't know where does Dracula keep his blood. You ready for this? Yeah. Here's at home. Holy hell. The blood bank. There you are. That's I. I don't know jokes. Okay. I um, <laughs> is the joke meant to be where does Dracula keep his money? Like I, I, I it's definitely. Actually, blood. no. Yeah, that's probably it. That, I think that's the joke. <laughs> I think Evans, Evans won by default already. <laughs> does uh, Evan have done have to tell one? Uh, no, hit me with no, a joke. I want to hear a joke from you. Uh, I want to hear an Evan joke. Can I just tell a Tim Vine joke? No, you can't tell other people's jokes. Uh, am I supposed to make one up? Sure. I'm not Tim Vine, for God's sake. I did. <laughs> hit, hit me with anything. Hit me with, you, you've won, pretty much. Uh, uh, well, what, uh, well, no. He could do one worse than me. He could. <laughs> if, if, this, if this joke is worse than Leon messing... If you mess this joke up worse than Leon, <laughs> then you could, you know, hand the you know the funny guy roll over to Leon. Uh, have, you got, have you got a joke for uh, me? Uh, w w why did the chicken cross the road? I don't know. Why did the chicken <laughs> cross the road? The, uh... uh, uh because it Leon, was... you're the funny guy. Yes! <laughs> because it was foul. 
Um, so that's your joke anyway, isn't it? <laughs> that didn't. Uh, so I don't get it. So he's the 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 female anchor, the funny female anchor. What am I? you I'm uh, not the funny one. I no, no, you no. You're that. the funny one. Uh, Even though you messed up the joke, yeah. you still did one better than me. Evan, right. Evan messed it up worse than you. I I fear for this week. Uh, <laughs> you both messed up a, jo- a joke. Can you come in every morning? I I may be able to. Can you take over just for the week? Just take over hosting the show? No, I... I, I do you have other things to do? I need to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Can I ask, uh, talking about TV hosts, is there any yeah. host that you idolise? TV hosts? Um, I really like David Letterman. I think he's mm-hmm. outstanding. That's interesting because we really idolise David Kosh because if I don't know if you can see... We worship um, him. Th- th- there's a picture here of... Oh, Koshy. This is, this right. is Koshy. Uh, if you can see that, there's uh, there's Koshy there. I'm more of a Stefanovic this, man this myself. Is really, Stefanovic. Ste- Stefanovic. Ste- Stefanovic. Um, I always get that wrong. Mm-hmm. We. <laughs> this is actually from my bedside table. Um, <laughs> I just family portraits. It in. Really? Family portraits and Koshy. Yeah, yeah, there's a bit of a stain. <coughs> no. Uh, so it's just a smudge on the. Just thing. a smudge. Yeah. yeah. Thomas, can I just say thank you for coming in? Oh, defi- thank you. And defining our roles this yeah. morning. Um, You're welcome. I, I'm uh, glad that I'm the funny one. Yeah. I'm You're not glad, glad that I'm the woman. At all. That's not. A good outcome. Well, I hope uh, it helped out. Thank you very much. We're going to equip. This is the verb, rather be. You're on <laughs> the week off on Channel 31. <laughs> Welcome back to the week off. See that? I'm, I'm anchoring. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was sorry. actually looking over there and then, oh, there you are. Sorry, continue I'm, though. I'm bad at this, sorry. <laughs> uh, apparently now our Twitter watch is up to date now. We're, we've got some new Twitters in. Is that yeah, correct? Our internet's working again. <laughs> so, uh, band or dial up, whatever I've got. Probably dial up here yeah. at Channel 31. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, are we, we checking in what what uh, Twitter updates have we had? Anything? Can we get them to come up? Have we got Twitter? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. We got Yoko Ono. Uh, in the process of trying to break up Matchbox 20, Rob Thomas is reluctant. Nice. Good one. I like it. Uh, yeah. Yoko Ono, actually, she does update quite a bit. Does she really? She's a good Twitterer. Yeah. Cool. Have we got any more Twitter updates? Celebrity Twitter updates? We've, Sam Neil. We do follow some interesting people. Sam Neil. Been practicing dancing with Monkey, waiting for call from Dancing with the Stars. Mm-hmm. I reckon he'd I've do well in Dancing with the Stars. Have we got, can we do one more update, do you think, before we go to a break? Perhaps? Yes? Maybe? JJ Abrams, waiting, writing the finale of Lost, Stuck for Ideas, anyone? Wow. Okay, good. <laughs> Any ideas for JJ Abrams? 0458 90 50 92 <laughs> is the number to text in. You're watching the week off. We're filling in for Get Serial TV. The new host will be taking over next week. Tune in, coming up, we've got a whole lot more, plus a scavenger hunt later on. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Right now we have the Cassette Kids. Welcome back, Melbourne, to uh, the week off. And Geelong. Don't forget Geelong. Oh, yeah, Geelong. Melbourne Melbourne and Geelong. But isn't Geelong sort of in Melbourne? (laughs) Nah. No. (laughs) Okay, Uh, so this is the week off, filling in for uh, Get Serial TV. It's Leon. And Evan, And myself, course. Evan, mm-hmm. of course. Now, uh, just before we move on with the show, I just need to check uh, that my car has still got, uh, you know, that I haven't got a fine. Parking so, uh, now, yeah, just, yeah. Uh, we're, we're going to live cross to uh, mm. Steph again. Uh, Steph, are you still there? Yeah, I'm still here. Oh, cool. Um, so, uh, ha- have I got much time left? Um, yeah, you got, uh, like, 19 minutes. 19 about. minutes. All right, cool. Uh, well... Great. That's that should should that last? I have even got a clock in front of me. Um, we'll check. I'll check with you later on, and we'll uh, we'll just make sure that's okay. Make sure. All right. <laughs> she seems. Was that exactly the same as last time when you checked no, in with her? No, 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 no. Remember Ooh. the other one was forty-seven minutes. Looks okay. Looks exactly the it's same. Not, uh, not suspicious at all. No, no. So uh, we actually also wanted to mention we've have actually been getting texts. You can in, text in oh four five eight. I feel like I'm on radio. Ninety fifty ninety two. Yeah. Text in anytime. We, we, someone just texted in saying, "Yum, you guys are hot." Well, I'm glad you're watching, Mum. <laughs> um, and uh, uh, and someone uh, named Nissa texted in just uh, th- mentioning that I did struggle to get up this morning, and uh, uh, I can tell <laughs> that uh, they're wondering if two of our crew people, Em and Tyson, that w- whether whether they struggled to get up. I think they were okay because, as you can see, we're actually on air, mm-hmm. so our crew um, crew seem to be going. Thanks for your worries, though. Um, okay. We are quickly are going to check in with uh, Twitter Watch just again, bef- uh, just quickly. Um, we are checking in, we're following celebrities on Twitter, seeing how they go, progress through the week. And just um, seeing what stands out. Yeah, exactly the, right. The, the more interesting ones, because so many celebrities do tweet. They do, yeah. Lots of them. I do. Almost all of them, in fact. How much free time do they have that I they're know. just sitting there on their computer like me? But right uh, in uh, fact, stop Twittering. I, <laughs> I'm actually going to update my Facebook status right now, live. Uh, no, I can't. You can't. Can we check the yeah. first, uh, first Twitter? Let's have a look in for Twitter. Mm. 
Whoa. Matthew Perry, having trouble conveying sarcasm in my tweets. P.S. Where's my career? Well, yeah. Oh, that's actually, he was in 17 again with Zac Efron. That's a step up. That's his career. All right. Yeah. Well, um, uh, th that's all that's coming in through Twitter, actually. Okay. So, uh, What I wanted to actually talk to you about, because front page of the paper, as we mentioned earlier, MasterChef makes the front page... Um, of the Herald are. Sun oh. and of The Age. Can I show you this and one the as, well? as well? It's the, the Age. It's here on The Age as well. The top uh, there... Apparently, we're not a credible news source unless we mention MasterChef today. So, yeah. <laughs> did you did you watch the show? Were you a fan no, of MasterChef? In fact, I've never seen... The only time I ever saw MasterChef was when I was just running through ABC one point and they had it on the TV there at ABC. Of course. This is weird. <laughs> and that's all I saw. Yeah, but, yeah. And, of course, bits and pieces on the news and, you know, that sort of Definitely. ad breaks, that sort of thing. I watched it last night because I, I, I think I got into it too late. I It started... Would have been. How long ago did it start? It's been going for about three months, isn't it? I, I wouldn't know. I don't know. I started watching it about two weeks ago and I got really hooked. You started two weeks ago? <laughs> two weeks ago. Wow. Um, so last night they had the, the two finalists, Poe and Julie. Of course, Julie ended up being the winner. Sorry for those who didn't see last night and are going to watch it later on today. They taped it. But um, uh, all these people, the, the ex-contestants were staying there. I didn't even know who any of them were. <laughs> The ex so the people who had already been like evicted from the yeah. the cooking the cooking house house. <laughs> Why would you evict people? Wouldn't you want more to eat? They just they apparently every time they evicted someone, they end up being the main course the next week. It was oh really? Very, sort of a cannibal Master Chef spin off, I think. But yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, just um, we've got an oh, we've got another tweet coming in. Wow, well, Moby. Moby. If only I had 140 characters when writing lyrics for my songs, might have to might make more sense. That's uh, true. I don't understand Moby's lyrics usually. Does he? Yeah, that's odd. Often he doesn't have lyrics, even. It, like, sometimes he sings them, sometimes he doesn't. <laughs> and sometimes he only has a few characters. Oh doesn't God. matter, you won't understand. Stick around, guys. We'll be back <laughs> right after this. We're going to be doing a scavenger hunt. It's going to get exciting in here. Stick around. Welcome back to the week off. We're doing the Forget Serial TV as the new hosts get prepared for the next week, starting next Monday. So we'll be here all week all having week. lots of fun, including an old favourite from Get Serial TV last season with Thomas and Camilla, the scavenger hunt. Yes. Yes. Uh, <laughs> for those who don't know, it's like the Amazing Race inside Channel 31's offices. Race. Yep. Except oh, for I that. I didn't see that show either. I don't watch much TV. Like, okay. Really Sorry. <laughs> but uh, yeah. So basically, I've I've got some clues, and there's items hidden around the Channel 31 building. Okay. And the rooftop. <laughs> I've added a new dimension. You can oh, go on the roof. No. 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 But um. Oh, so I will give you the clues, and you have to go find them as quickly as possible. In my pajamas. In your pajamas. Around the office, a professional organisation. <laughs> in my pajamas. You're the one wearing the pajamas. All right. Do we your first clue? Do you want your first All clue? Right, Don't yeah. look. First Alrighty, clue. here's your first clue. I'm ready? ready. Hidden shivering behind a door, you'll find a Scottish dinosaur. Okay, all right. There's your clue. Run around. And he's off. I th oh, hey, knocked the newspapers, thank you. So shivering, hidden shivering behind a door, you'll find a Scottish dinosaur. Now, for the viewers at home, um, <laughs> he's, running he's, he's running around everywhere. Oh. Behind f Listen to the clue, Evan, you numb skull. <laughs> Can I say numb skull on air? Yeah, it's not, it's not offensive. Hidden shivering behind a door, you'll find a Scottish dinosaur. Shivering is the clue there. He's not... Don't give... The, the crew's giving clues. Don't do that. <laughs> there are other doors on that fridge, you idiot. <laughs> I said hidden shivering behind a door. You're a simple... <laughs> A Scottish dinosaur. Is it cold? Yes. It's, it's a amazing. Scottish dinosaur. Give me the Scottish dinosaur. There we are. That's the Scottish dinosaur. Here we are. <laughs> it's been freezing. I can't do Scottish accents. Sorry. Clue number two. Uh, it's Clue yeah. number two. With, stop looking. With a packet that's blue on an important desk, you'll find something to freshen your breath. Go. Okay. Okay. Fly, my pretty. Fly. It actually is quite funny to see him running around in his pajamas. So, the clue again, with a packet that's blue on an important desk, you'll find something to freshen your breath. He's found it, that's, that's the, the ex-general manager's office, he's found some chewing gum. That was really well done, you got that really quickly. Yeah, important desk. He found, he found important desk, he's found some chewing gum, and that's a hint, take some. Oh. No, no, clue three, clue three. In a room of junk further south is something waiting to wash your mouth. <laughs> Run! Okay. Run, faster! Alright, so the clue again, in a room of junk further south is something waiting to wash your mouth. 
He's in the, the green room, which is aptly <laughs> coloured blue there for some reason. The room of junk. He's found it! Some mouthwash! <laughs> He's doing quite well, actually. The pyjamas is giving him advantage, I think. Do I love both clues I've given? Uh, two of them, actually, out of the three. <laughs> mouthwash and chewing gum. Take a hint! <laughs> no, okay. Final clue. Clue oh, four. Clue four. You're almost there. No time to stop. In a coloured room, there's two things to pop. In a coloured room? Go! Go! Yeah. What place is coloured? I know! Use your brain. Well, what's left of it? So the clue again, you're almost there. No time to stop. In a coloured room, there's two things to pop. For the viewers at home, there's two balloons in a room. He has to go pop them. Camera, can we, can we, we've lost him. We've lost Evan. Where's Evan gone? <laughs> if he's found these clues, he better not be cheating. He's got them. Bring them back. I left an appropriately placed skewer next to the balloons for you to pop them. Oh, Go back and get the skewer. <laughs> Go and get the skewer. We don't have time for this. Go and get the skewer. He's not cheating. Oh, oh. <laughs> Seeing that footage of you, oh god, don't do it in my part. <laughs> I'm frightened. <laughs> There's another one. Congratulations, you're a winner. Wow. Congratulations. <sighs> <sighs> Stressed, uh, hey? Yeah, that's I know. Stressful. Do you know what I love seeing you run around in your pajamas <laughs> out there. I just imagined you at home, and your mum's like, "Evan, breakfast is ready." <laughs> you run down the stairs in your in your pajamas. How did you, how did you, did you <laughs> like my clues? Did you, Yes. Can you talk? Are you they, right? uh, they rhymed. Can you I didn't like this one. It, what did you say? Uh, behind a door. Behind, freezing behind a door. Oh. Uh, Be sorry, hidden shivering behind a door. Uh, it's cold. I didn't pick the shivering. Oh. Not good then, is it? So, I, I like scavenger hunt. I like Does it too. Thomas and Camilla come up with this. Can, mm. I, I would like to be tested sometime during the week. Oh, yeah, scavenger definitely. Hunt. You're going to go on. <laughs> I'll get you in your pyjamas. Uh, <laughs> the most awkward thing possibly for him to say. <laughs> Thank you for that. No, I'm sure this week I won't be in my pyjamas, but... Um, okay. But we'll be doing a scavenger hunt again, please. Yeah, Good. definitely. I'll write you up some clues. We don't have to take my thing. Uh, we're going to be going to a clip. No, we're not going to a clip, apparently. No. Yes, we are going to a clip, apparently. <laughs> this is the Kooks. Do you want to? You're watching the week off on Channel 31. <laughs> Where Whoa. are we? This one. Hey. Whoa. Wow, that was different. These cameras hey, are change crazy of pace, today. perhaps. Yeah. Wow, look at that angle. That's Welcome nice. back to the week off. Uh, we're here to wrap up. Yeah, no, I actually, just quickly, uh, Steph is still at my car, um, I think. Are, are you still there, Steph? Uh, are we check? Yeah, I'm here. Oh, cool. Okay, so uh, um, uh, how, how long is there left on my car? Yeah, got about five minutes left. Hang on, wait. That's not even my car, though. Like, that, my car's blue. <laughs> um, oh, okay. Where's my car? Where'd it go? I don't know. Is that oh, it well, driving off in the around. background? Is that where, it driving off in the background? There it is. Oh, See, okay. look, there it is. Okay, I'll go. I'll go. go, like, go find it. She, she lost my car. Like, that wasn't even my car. Okay, oh, yeah, uh, sorry. Kind of got a ticket. You got a ticket? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, that's your own fault there. Uh, <laughs> thank you very much for tuning in with us for the week off. <sighs> I'm losing camera angles. Where are we going? Uh, I think we're over here. Thank you very much for Thomas for coming in. Um, for giving us tips on yeah. how to host. Hopefully we're doing a good job. I don't thanks know. for Steph for mining my car. Mm -hmm. No! Yep. No, uh, no, and everyone down the Mutant Way, thank you very much for letting us uh, infiltrate the building and, and um, harass some of the celebrities, including yep. Nikki Osborne. And again, Nikki, if uh, the marriage doesn't work out, you know where I am. <laughs> uh, it's not awkward at all. Uh, make sure you tune in all this week um, because we've got a huge It's going to be amazing. We've got special guests lined up to come in. Can we give some clues? We can. Johnny well, Johnny Cash might be in. <laughs> yeah. Johnny Cash is coming into the show. Well, not what well, not him personally. The singer no. Tex Perkins, who's doing a show about Johnny Cash, may be in yeah. to have a chat with him. I'd love to, you Penciled know, in, yeah, in. something like that. Uh, and perhaps um, Adam Rosenbach's. I've yeah, heard. perhaps we might get a little bit of Rosie on in the studio. Rosie. Rosie, that's what we call him. You know, <laughs> but when you're friends with him, you, you call him Rosie. Oh, okay. Dropping names now, are we? Uh, as well as that, I'm looking forward to Wednesday because not many people know that Wednesday is Pi Approximation That's Day. That's right, because it's the 22nd of the 7th, and 22 divided by 7 
is approximately 3.14, which is pie. So <laughs> Geeks, ahoy. So make sure you tune in <laughs> all this week. Amazing. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you very much. Bye.